We have an amazing power supply to introduce to you today. Let's take a look at MeWell's UHP 1500 HV power supply. This is a 1500 watt high voltage fanless industrial power supply and it's manufactured by MeanWell. This high performance power supply is really an amazing 1500 watt power supply and I'm really excited about walking you through it today. Now this power supply does not get 100% load when you're operating at low line, even though it's universal AC input range. So if you take a look here at the derating curve versus AC input voltage, you'll see between 90 and 180 volts AC input, you don't actually achieve the maximum output power capabilities of this power supply. In order to leverage the maximum output power capabilities, you would need to operate this at an input voltage of 180 volts AC to 264 volts AC. So when you're specking in this power supply, be very aware of your input voltage. Now this power supply will convert that AC voltage to DC output voltage, and there's three different high voltage DC outputs that this power supply can provide in three different models. You have 115 volts DC, 230 volts DC, and 380 volts DC. Meanwhile designed this power supply for the increased market demands of systems demanding high power and high DC voltages, such as lasers, electrolysis, DC centralized bus power, and charging systems. It's really impressive because this is a fanless power supply, and there's actually three different ways that you can cool this power supply. One is conduction, another way is forced air, and the other method is convection cooling. And what I like to do is show you these three different options and how the operating temperature range and derating will vary. Now for conduction cooling, you must properly mount it to a base plate. And as you can see here, we're illustrating the proper mounting style to mount to a base plate so you get that proper conduction cooling. When conduction cooling, you have certain derating and here's the derating curve. So derating begins at 40 or 50 degrees Celsius, and that depends on your input voltage as illustrated here. And you will be able to operate this power supply up to 70 degrees Celsius ambient temperature when you're using conduction cooling. When you're using forced air cooling, you will need to have an external fan for the power supply in your system that will provide 40 CFMs of air onto the power supply. When cooling with this method, derating begins at 50 degrees Celsius and once again, you can operate this power supply up to 70 degrees. For convection cooling, this is when you're not providing any forced air, you're just cooling it via convection. The power supply actually derates to 70% of its maximum rated output power for the complete operating temperature range. Now, additional derating occurs at 45 degrees Celsius and above, and when you're convection cooling this power supply, the maximum operating ambient temperature actually is only 60 degrees Celsius versus the 70 degrees Celsius for the other two cooling methods. Now, there's a lot of great features I like about this power supply. There's many of them, so let's just rapid fire them so that I can highlight them for you. First, slim 1U profile, auxiliary 12 volt DC output available. There's a built-in remote on off function. You have remote sense. We have an LED indicator for power on and it will withstand 5G anti-vibration. A couple of functions that will be really necessary for many of the intended applications are programmable output voltage and also programmable constant current. So that means you can program the output voltage and also you operate this in constant current mode and program that constant current. This power supply is also optionally available with PM bus or CAN bus protocol which allows you to enable communication interface. Let's talk safety and compliance and review that. First, this power supply has global safety certifications and that's always true with Meanwhile's products. They do an amazing job of making sure they receive global safety certifications. Specifically, we have ULTUVEN 62368-1 certification. And also on the compliance side, this power supply is over voltage category three, which means this power supply can be directly connected in an OVC3 environment. Now I mentioned this power supply was 1U low profile, but it's really pretty small coming at only 11.4 inches by 5.5 inches by 1.6 inches in height. 
This power supply also has all the necessary protections. We have short circuit protection, overload protection, over voltage protection, and over temperature protection. Typical of Meanwell, they come in with a confident five-year manufacturer's warranty. So once again, when you use this power supply, you're having confidence that the manufacturer is standing behind the quality of this power supply. Okay, that wraps up this power supply. You know, we're really truly excited about introducing this power supply to the marketplace and to our clients. Now, if you would like any more information or simply need help selecting this power supply, contact us. You can give us a call, visit our website, and we'll help eliminate the complexities of selecting this power supply and provide you all the information that you need. Now, this power supply is a little complex and it has a lot of features and functions that you can leverage. So we can also set you up for success and assist you with properly operating these features and functions. So if you need any assistance with using this power supply and implementing it into your system, we have an amazing engineering team that will be excited to help you. I hope that you enjoyed this power spotlight and found your information valuable. Don't forget to subscribe to us and like this video. I look forward to introducing you the next amazing power supply from TRC Electronics.